Al, here we go. The MSG 150 final, the fastest 150 seconds in the National Hockey League. Tomorrow, Rangers at the Caps. Our coverage begins here tomorrow at noon. Game at 12:30. The last of a six-game road trip for the Caps this afternoon at Buffalo. Jason Pominville makes it one nothing Sabres. So Washington's going to have the six-game road trip end and then play tomorrow in the second of a back-to-back. -back. Alexander Ovechkin, 44th of the year, that leads the league. Here he comes. It's now a 2-1 game. Caps on the board. That's a count. 2-1. Final second, second period. Rasmus Dahlin, the rookie defenseman, scores from Jack Eichel. Sabres up 3-1. Watch it again. 3-1 in the third cap trying to come back. Andre Burakowski here for the Caps. About five minutes into the third period. And Washington is within one at 3-2. Nice shot there. But the story of this game, the play of Sam Reinhardt for the Sabres, a hat trick. This is his second of the game. He finished with three, and the Sabres beat the Caps. Final score, five to two. Before they were the Maple Leafs, Toronto was the St. Patrick's, and they're bringing back the St. Patrick's jerseys to be worn March 15th and 16th. The 17th, of course, is St. Patrick's Day. Garrett Sparks, the goalie, has his pads all set. It remains to be seen if he'll play in any of those games. Patrick Line, what a strange year, scored 18 goals in November and since has gone ice cold, had gone 15 straight games without a goal before scoring twice last night in Winnipeg's 6-3 win over Vegas. So Line has 27 goals on the season, only nine in months other than November. Edmonton plays Anaheim tonight. They'll be without Connor McDavid. He gets suspended for two games by the league for this hit Thursday night on the Isles. Nick Letty. Letty able to finish the game and thankfully was not injured on the hit. Last night, Minnesota beat Detroit 3-2. Marcus Foligno is Cronwall by Nicholas Cronwall. That's a clean hit. And it was quite a hit from the Detroit veteran defenseman. And the Pee Wee Rangers playing in the 60th annual Quebec International Hockey Tourney. This is video of their 3-1 win Thursday. They played in the quarters this afternoon and lost to the Czech Knights 3-2. But what a great showing here by this group, an international tournament. This is a bunch of youngsters chosen to represent the Rangers organization in national and international tournaments, and they made it all the way to the quarterfinals.